Well, good morning, all reachers. Um, as you can see, I'm sitting in my garden in sunny Devon underneath an apple tree, and I'm actually wearing my special uh, reach sunglasses. It doesn't always have sunshine in Devon, but of course it is at the moment, so I'm making the most of it. I'm very lucky to have a very big garden, which means there's a lot to do. Weeding, mowing lawns, and here we will see I have one of my great delights, which is my fish pond. The fish in here I've had since they were quite small, and now, although the it's quite dark, and I don't know that you can see them, but they are very big. course we can't spend all day and every day in the sunshine because it isn't like that and sometimes we have to come inside and work and luckily as you can see I have a wonderful study and I'm sure you have wonderful areas you can play in your bedroom or hiding behind the sofa or doing what you do. Uh, here is where I read and as I'm the mayor and a councillor I do have a lot of work to do via the computer. I'm very lucky that in order to use the cursor I can't use an iPad or laptop, I use a, what we call a PC and I do have something which I call my rat. Don't be worried, it's not a real rat. You've heard of a mouse because they're quite small and with my feet I need something much bigger and this is my rat. That's the ball which moves the cursor and that's the click that clicks to so that I can see what I'm doing. And as you can see, this afternoon I have a very important meeting and here is the document and I'm going to read it and make some notes because I'm expected to know what I'm talking about. Page 33, the parish council objected. One of the wonderful things about this study is it contains so much of my life and family. I have five children, and here they are up on the wall. All of them have degrees, I'm glad to say, and four of them are married and all have children. So I have six grandchildren, yes, six grandchildren. And I'm pleased to say that we meet each other as often as we can by using, yes, you've guessed it, the internet, the telephone, because only two of my grandchildren live locally. This is her feet when she was 11 weeks old and she is now 10. So there we are. So I can tell you her feet are a lot bigger, but unlike her grandfather, she can't use them the way I do. Because I have to. Little terrace where we can have breakfast. May I suggest that when you can, go outside to eat. It's easy to sit down and have a sandwich and a drink and to enjoy life here, the wonderful smells of all the flowers in the garden and to listen to the birds, particularly if you hear the blackbird calling from the top of the tree. <laughs> 